Hey guys, I'm going to give, oops, I forgot to turn on Facebook. Uh, where is Facebook here? Hold on. Did Facebook just conk out on me? Hold on. Hey, I'm trying to see why. Oh, my iPad decide to die, so I can't even do my Facebook Live along with Instagram. Okay. Hey, how are you? I'm going to give it a few minutes for people to jump on because I kind of want you guys' participation for me to pick the winner. So let me give it a minute. And I thought my iPad was being charged, but I guess not. Um, one second. How are you guys? Hope you guys had an amazing day. I hope we have some more participants because we need to be able to pick the winner for Wishlist Wednesday. So who do we have on with me? Because I see two names, but I see um, only one person right now. Okay, to get started, let me, first of all, I got my pouches, and I'm trying to feel, it came out really, really nice. If it doesn't grow from the ground, it's not in my bag. That came out really nice. Feeding my skin, I think I'm going to have to do it over. It doesn't look as clear especially the logo down here. And then we have two sizes. So you can see the big and the small. Hey, Isabel, I'm kind of just passing time to give a few more people um, time to jump on so we could pick tonight's winner. But in the meantime, I'm showing you guys the pouches. So this one is big. So this one you could put shampoo, conditioner, um, gosh, you could put so many different things in here. It's so big. And the smaller ones, you could put smaller items, travel size items. I am doing great, how about you? I'm still trying to feel, I think I have to work on the printing a little bit better because my logo is not as clear as I want it. Like this one, the logo looks smudged. and But this one, the logo looks nice and clear. So I'm trying to figure out what's going on. And this one, the bamboo doesn't go all the way to the top. It kind of goes, you know, starts here and stops here. So I'm not too crazy about that. But I'll figure it out. I mean, this is my first time doing this, so I'll learn and grow as I go. But I think this is exciting to have. So I ordered one of each for myself just to have it and, you know, get a feel and know what to tell customers when they want to order. Okay, so today was um, Wishlist Wednesday. So basically... I was planning for the month of December to take seven days from December the 1st to December the 7th and just give away products because I love to give and it's the holidays and I thought 
You know, I can randomly pick people to gift the product to. And then I came up with this whole seven day of skin food games, which has been amazing and a lot of fun. So the first game, you had to pick the herb that I was infusing before I made my oatmeal solve. And after a ton of guesses, someone was able to finally guess that it was chickweed. So on Monday night, I did a live stream educating people about chickweed, what chickweed is all about, what you can do internally and externally with chickweed. So that was a very, very good live stream. Yesterday, the question was, what is the very first product that I ever made um, that I ever made. Give me just a second, guys, because my iPad came on, so maybe I can jump on um, Facebook Live, too. So give me one second. Hold on. Win, winner, okay. Okay, so I was able to jump on live on Facebook and I'm live on Instagram. So Instagram, we already got started. Facebook, they'll just catch up as I'm talking. And let me move this in an area where it's not covering Facebook Live. So, as I was saying, yesterday's question was, um, what is the very, very first product that I ever made in my entire life? And for those that have heard my story, I've blogged about it. I even have it on my about page. So I don't talk about it often, but I did go over it last night on the live stream of how I got started. And the very first product I made was a lotion bar. So some people are familiar with the lotion bar and some people are not. Basically, it's a hard bar that once you place on your body, it starts to melt and you use it to apply moisture to your body. Whatever you have left, you put in the container and you use it next time. So that was the very first product that I ever made in my entire life. Now, today's game and I didn't announce how many days I'm going to have my game, but I'm going to be doing the game for seven days. So there will be seven opportunities for people to be able to win a product. So for the first game, Monday's game, the um, sophisticated Elisa picked the mini pine tar and scar butter set. Yesterday's winner... Um, Oh my gosh, I forgot how to say her Instagram name. But yesterday's winner, I love what she picked. She picked the Haitian hair oil, the two ounce Haitian hair oil. So that's going to be her prize. Today's winner, once we pick the winner together, then I'll go ahead and send them an Instagram DM and ask them what they would like to select. So, they, so at the end of the seven days, I can ship everybody's gift to them. The way it works, you pay $5 for shipping and you pick a product, one product up to $20 value and that's the product you receive for you to use, for you to try and whatnot. So today was called Wishlist Wednesday and what it was was an opportunity to go to my website, look at everything on my website and add it to your wish list. So as a group, collectively, we're going to pick the winner for tonight and the way we're going to do that is we're going to pick a number. Everybody's going to pick a number. And whoever comes up with a number that's close to a number, let's say some people pick five, some people say seven, 13, 40, whatever. Whatever group of numbers that are close together, we will finalize the number, one number, and I will go on my um, website and go to the wish list cart and we will pick a customer together. So I didn't even go on my website all today. I didn't go look at the wish list. 
I didn't want to have anybody's name in mind. I didn't want to see any numbers. So I didn't want it to throw me off. So that's why I was like, it would be so cool if we all do it together and pick the winner. So um, let's get started. So here's the background for my website. I have a WordPress website and I'm on WooCommerce. So let me go to... Facebook is acting up tonight, so I guess Facebook is just going to have to get the replay. Uh, or is my iPad acting up? I'll figure that after. Okay, so I'm going to go to... my wish list and before I even do I don't want it to load I want each of you guys to enter a number just type in a number it could be your favorite number it could be whatever number pop in your head I have a number in my head you guys give me a number and let's see what is the closest that we can get and let's see if we can pick a winner together. If you're just jumping on, if you're just joining, please enter a number in the comment. Whatever number you want to enter, enter it into the comment box so we can pick a winner. Oh, how about I do that myself? Hold on. I'm going to pick my favorite number. Okay, so far we have 15, we have 2, we have 7, we have 8, that's about 4 answers, and we have 2 more people on live, and then mine, so 3 more people, we're waiting on 3 more numbers. This is so much fun to me. I don't know what the range is. That's a good question. But honestly, I did not go look at my wish list. So I have no clue how many people signed up to have a wish list. So I don't know. I honestly don't know. Should I go see what the range is? You guys let me know what's the best way to do it. Should I go see what the range is and we pick a number again? Or we'll just finalize the number out of the numbers that we have. We have 14, we have 15. Let me actually write this down. We have 14, we have 15, we have seven, we have eight, we have six. 14, six, seven, we have two, we have 15, and we have eight. So. Someone said no, so okay, don't go look at, I'm confused. One said no, one said yes. What do I do? Just finalize a number out of the numbers we have or go look at the wish list and see how many people added, you know, how many, how many is on my wish list. Put yes for wish list, no for wish list. Yes, go look at the wish list, or no, don't go look for the wish. Uh, look at the wish list, and then we'll just pick the numbers from here. Cause the numbers are all pretty close. Oh, I didn't finalize now. No one went out of sight of a range of below sixteen. <laughs> She's like finalize now. I want to know. Okay, so we have. Okay, I think you should, and then we pick a number again. Okay. Let me go see how many people applied for the wish list. One second. You, you guys could clearly tell I didn't have this planned out, right? Okay. Um... Hold on, I'm gonna tell you. Right now I can see I have nine pages 
of people that signed up for the wish list. But some of those people did not open an account. So I, if I open the wish list, I won't know. So let's do this. Here, here's what we can do. I have nine pages so we can narrow down. The first number that we collectively pick will be the page number. And then the second number we collectively pick will be the person. So I'm going to tell you how many people on a page. One second. There's 10 people per page. So let's pick the page number first. I already said seven. Let's all pick a page number together. And then we'll, from the page number, we'll pick uh, the person. Of people who did wish list go in. What do you mean by that? Five. So again, we have nine pages. Let's pick what page number we want to do. Five, five, okay. Let me get one more person and then we'll oh now we have two seven two five. So somebody break the ice. Break break that um break that um uh, tie. Okay, so somebody broke the tie. We're going to go to page seven. And remember, on page seven, we'll have 10 people. This computer is so slow, guys. I'm sorry about that. I'm still trying to get to page seven. Okay. Page seven. I'm going to tell you how many people on page seven. Okay. On page seven, we have three people that enter the wish list. Like I said, although there's nine pages, a lot of people created a wish list and didn't put their name. So. I'm not going to vote for this because you guys could already see that I saw the name. So I'm not going to vote for this. But as you can see, like you see the wish lists are created, but here's where I could see the names. So if there's no name there, I won't be able to see who wished for the person. So we have three people on page seven where I can actually see who the person is. Let me just double check one second. Yeah. So I have three people that I can see who the name is. Who will it be? Number person number one, person number two, or person number three? We have one person that says number three. Come on, guys. We just got to pick one, two, or three. We got one person that says two. <laughs> you guys are killing me. So we got one, two, two, a three. Oh. So it looks like number two is the one that has, hold on, let me write this right. We got a three, we got a two. Then a one, then a two, then a two. 
Okay, so we have one one, three twos, and two threes. So the winner is gonna be number two. Oh Lord, someone said number three. So we're tied between number two and number three. So we're down to person number two and person number three. Are we going to go for door number three, guys? Give me some yeses or some noes or actually put the numbers so we can finalize. We can make a deal. This is harder than I thought. Thank goodness there wasn't like a ton of people on the live. We are, we are tied at three and two. And each person that responds continues the tie. So the next person that responds, whatever that number is, that's what I'm going to go with. I know it's horrible. And I have no say so at this point because I saw the names. Three, we're going with three. And you know what? Three is my favorite number. So that's perfect. So winner number three is, I don't know if you guys could see. Her name is Blondine is Natty. Blondine is Natty. So I'm not sure if she's an Instagram customer and it's so cute because she has six items in her wish list. So let's see what those items are. Oh, this is so much fun. Okay, let's see what's on her. What items she has. Okay. And it's so cute because on my website, you can name your wish list. So one of my customers, the name of her wish list is back to baby skin. So she wants her skin to be soft again. That is so cute. Okay, Blondie is naughty. She has six items in her wish list. And let's see what those items are. I just want to see her wish list, guys. What's going on? This is my first time going into my wish list. So let's see if I can actually see what her wish list is. This is what happens when you're live. You're actually having to do everything live. So when there's a problem, I'm going to try this one more time because I'm trying to see what's inside her wish list. If it does not allow me to go inside her wish list, then I will email her and, oh, I got it. Okay. So this is what she picked. She picked, the, so her, her six wish items are turmeric soap. The pine tar and scar butter set, a sample size scar butter, the Haitian hair oil, the herbal hair mist, the Haitian hair butter. So I'm going to type in, no, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to repeat it again because maybe we could just pick the gift for her, right? I don't have to pick it. We can pick it. So again, she got, she wants either the Haitian hair butter, the herbal hair mist, the Haitian hair oil, the scar butter, the pine tar and scar butter set, or a turmeric soap. What do you guys think I should give her? You guys pick it for her. Turmeric soap, mini pine tar set, 
Haitian hair oil, herbal hair mist, or the Haitian hair butter. Um, my newest addition would be the Haitian hair oil. That's my newest addition. And that's actually the most expensive out of, no. And then the Haitian hair butter, it, it takes it to the max. Give her the pine tar set. Herbal hair mist. Something she hasn't tried. I don't know what she's tried before. I don't, I don't even know if she's ever purchased for me before. I can't see her. I just, yeah, I don't, I would have to go. Remember, this is my brand new website. So I don't have tracking for any customers that's here right now. I would have to go on Etsy to see um, if she's ordered before. Remember, the gift is one item up to $20. So giving her the hair set would be a $40 value. And the value for the for the um for the games are up to twenty dollar value. So should I give her the Haitian hair oil? That's my newest thing. That's the the newest one. Let's finalize it. Oil. Okay, just if, if somebody agrees, one more person, let's touch and agree. <laughs> let's touch and agree on the Haitian hair oil, and that will wrap it up for Wishlist Wednesday. I need one more person to agree. Come on, guys. I still have four people online. The other people got off there like, uh, I didn't win, so it's time for me to go. Me, myself, and I. That's three. Do you know what? That's you? <laughs> Wait. That's you? You're the winner? Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought you were the winner. I'm like, oh, that's so cool. She's on live. Okay, so let me know if you touch and agree. Hey, how are you? Let me know. Okay, so then she's getting the Haitian hair oil. So there you have it, guys. So I always use your pine tar and scar butter. Thank you. You are the winner. You're Blondie. Really? Ah, oh, yay. That is so cool. So you're the winner and you're going to get the Haitian hair oil. So after the live stream, please send me a DM with your information. Actually, you could just come pick it up from me. Um, but let's connect after live stream. That is so cool that the winner was on and watched the whole process of us picking her. So at least you guys know where I'm doing this for real. And I'm just not like picking people that I know or whatnot. I really want it to be something that we can have fun and I love to give. And sometimes I give a little bit too much, but when I can kind of reel it in and do it around Christmas time and do it around games, it's so much fun. So tomorrow, um, the game for tomorrow is um, you have to tell me what is my skincare regimen. So you can't answer till tomorrow when I post it tomorrow morning and you have to tell me exactly what I use every single day as my skincare regimen and the person I will announce the winner tomorrow night and I may even talk about a little bit of the products that I use for Friday. You guys still have like four more opportunities to win. For Friday, you post a video of what it is that you like about Donata Skin Food or Donata, and you post it on your Instagram and you tag me. Remember, you cannot have a private account. If you have a private account, I will not see the tag. So I prefer to play Friday's game with people that have a public account so that I could see the tag. So again, for Friday, you post a 30 second, a one minute video of what you like about Donata Skin Food, what you like about Donata, 
or if there's a particular product you really want to win, you could talk about that product and why you should win it. Maybe for Friday, maybe I'll, you know, go cut past through my $20 max and, and um, do a little bit more for that, for that um, award for Friday. We'll see how I'm feeling on Friday. But that's the game for Friday. And I'm looking for somebody that's really enthusiastic. Maybe even somebody that's shy and breaks out of their shell to do the video. I'm always about inspiring people. Even the kids that I, I sub at school, I have them get up and do presentations. And the ones that are scared to talk in front of people, I force them to get up and do presentations. So if you're shy and you've never done a video, this is the perfect time to break out of your shyness and give somebody else another business a shout out. And in doing so, enter to win Friday's um, contest. And then there's going to be a contest for Saturday. And then there will be a contest for Sunday. Sunday is the last day for, for my skin food games. And all of the winners, their products will be shipping out next week. Again, don't forget, it's $5 shipping. Of course, if you live in Miami, you just come pick it up from me. There's no $5 shipping. You just get your product. Thank you guys for joining me. Let me look at these comments real quick. I didn't miss anything. Oh, you couldn't comment for some reason. The enemy was mad because you won because <laughs> you won your gift. That's too funny. <laughs> Thank you for helping. Oh yay! Well, I'm glad I, I found out during the live stream that you're the winner. That's exciting. Thank you guys for joining. I appreciate all your love and care for Donata Skin Food. Stay tuned to tomorrow's post so that you have another chance to win at one of my skin food products. You guys have an awesome and amazing night. Bye.